So this is a blue beetle. Right there. And I hope you can call my finger and show you. Yeah. Got it on my finger. So a habitat is where the creature lives. Like this habitat is in trees. So this little creature's habitat, what you see over here. We cannot get enough of our next guest, six-year-old YouTube sensation whose nature and animal videos have some calling him the next David Attenborough. Please welcome Anishwar. 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 Thank you for taking the time to uh, to talk to us, buddy. First of all, how old are you and what country are you Zooming in from? So I'm six years old and I'm Zooming from UK, England. How did you get interested in wildlife in the beginning? So it's all about just knowing about the wildlife. When I started to know about them, had the topic of wildlife, I started to know wildlife is more important than just knowing about your things. You're right. It is very important. So smart of you to recognize that. So tell us about your YouTube videos and, and what kind of information are you sharing about animals? So I'm sharing information like knowing about the animal itself and getting to know about it is more better of knowing if it's in danger or if it's not. But we have to make sure every single cut is important and we have to save all of it. Well, we know that you love David Attenborough, who of course narrates Planet Earth, love which we Planet know you've Earth. seen tons of times. Mm -hmm. I want to take a look at a video where you're outside and you're educating us on African elephants. Because mud is just like a bug spray and it cools down, down in hot days. If you were an African elephant, you could get dirty and your mom would not even be angry. Would you like to be one of them? Because you love getting messy, if you like it. I'm with you, Anishwar. I'm all about getting dirty and mom not getting mad. Yeah. That's Anish kind of cool. <laughs> cool. Yeah, it's actually very good for it. Yeah, they even throw sand on their backs. Yeah, they do. They it do. keeps they keep their skin, cool. yeah, and the sunscreen. Now, do you have a favorite animal? Do you have any pets at home? So first, I have two fishes, what looks like zebras, and their white bit looks more of a gold color, okay? Okay. Second, I got two other fishes, what have blue sides, one is big and one is smaller. Got it. Yeah, and I have few algae eating fishes. Wow. All of them have like a rib bone going past that. His name is Hyde because he's a bit nervous and like to hide more. That's a smart, <laughs> that's a smart name. What's the other one's name? Oh, great. Like the big blue side. That's his name, big blue side. Oh, oh, big yeah, blue of side. Hoover, <laughs> come on. Oh, God, get it Keep together. Up, Hoover. I'm sorry, Anishwar. I apologize <laughs> for it. Listen, before we let you go, you got a whole zoo right there at your house, practically. We, we want you to tell us one fun fact for each of the following, okay? A hummingbird. Yeah. So hummingbirds can fly up, down, left, right, and even hover in one spot, just like on that scene when it's drinking nectar. It wants to come very close to bright objects, and it has a sensory what makes it know when a bright object is nearby and then it just goes straight for it and then get its hovering powers into place it doesn't go flat forward and backwards got it it goes in the cage yeah and, it, and did you know it can fly very easily but hardly can walk that means it can't even walk it can't even wow. walk it's like a helicopter that's cool I like to that. know okay yeah. what about a puffin if you see on this screen they have a lot of fish that's exactly how the beak is designed to hold things. And this is crazy cool. It can hold 62 fishes. Wow. In its wow. I can do that too, Anishwar, yeah. just so you know. He might even do 64. I'm you like got to come to set. What about a peregrine falcon? Isn't that the fastest bird ever? Yep. And you want to hear, see how speedy it is? When it goes in the plunging mode, it can dive. 200 miles per hour. Wow. That is yeah. unbelievable. And when they want to attack, they spread out their feet and put them in front of their 
whole body and then they clutch onto their prey. They flap hard to get into the air again. They can glide again. Cool. Wow. Right? Super cool. You're super, super cool. cool. And you are super cool. And listen. Yeah, Hubby's got an agent. That kid's a star. Yep. You can check out more of Anishwar's wildlife videos on his YouTube channel. Thanks, Anishwar. And up next, renovation pros behind HGTV's Going for Sold are back with a new show that you're going to love. And we're going to talk to them next.